Alright guys, this is Eric from Wigix. Um, today I'm gonna show you uh, roughly about three games I've got from the Iva store this week. Uh, the first one I'm gonna show you has a really weird game, re really weird name. It's named as uh, Meow Meow Happy Fight. Uh, so let's take a look at it. Right. <clears throat> The, as you can see, um, the basic graphic style are quite cute, and it's full of Japanese wacky style, and it's pretty nice. It fully supports iPhone 4 Retina display, so um, it's really enjoyable thing when you're playing that on your iPhone 4. Um, basically. It's, it is very cute, but it's a dual, shoulder, dual stick shoulder game. Um, it has its own unique style. I've never seen a similar dual shoulder game like this. Uh, yeah, I've been playing. I, I've, I've been, I've been playing a lot of um, dual shoulder games like um, Mini Gore or something like that. But this one is really um, different. Um, as you can see here. Uh, these are the characters I am able to unlock and to use within the game. Uh, this, see here, I even got a noodle cup, a hamster, spot key, zombie boy. Um, each of these characters have uh, different level of skills, of the initial skills, like um, the character other behind have the, the, the more powerful skills. Uh, basically I'm gonna use my Shingo here. See the happy point here. Um, you can you can get some happy points after each uh, battle, each stage. Uh, these happy points can be used as credits or money within the game. So you can use the happy points to unlock the different characters. See the cat four characters if you want to use that. Uh, you have to spend 50 happy points, and I've got uh, 136 points here. So I'm gonna quickly, I'm gonna quickly show you through the game. Uh, we just use the shingle here. Uh, what we're looking at now is basically a, a Tokyo map. Uh, see the whole story just happens in the, in, in the Tokyo area. So we have to pick up the different uh, stars shows where. You got a events there, so there's a, a star shining there. I've completed the last of four stages, so we just go into this new one. Um, yeah. So that's level five, and that's my character here, surrounded by a bubble, which like a kind of shield, uh, and that indicate lights here shows you where is it is your enemy uh, so my enemy is somewhere there they're using a whack see right after you defeat the enemy uh, you can be able to drop up some um, items for you to pick up some items are really uh, funny um, like a toilet paper, uh, fashion designer accessories, even some noodles and food things. So oh, I've been killed again. I've been frozen by the noodle. That's a shame. I've got a Fast movement skill. And pick up the item they drop, and that's your healthy recover. Up and so that frozen thing is really annoying. Right, that, that. See the item I pick up with the that on it. Basically, it's a quite powerful um, firepower. So.
and you can see it runs quite smoothly on my iPhone 4 um, graphics are dynamic and each see each set you will have normally like uh, two minutes time um, you have to kill as many as you can when the time's up um, who kills the most who will win the game so you can't actually hide all the time because you will lose the game even you were not killed for only one time um, so basically the technique will just go 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 and just kill as many enemies as you can and you have to pay attention to those uh, special items because they're really helpful for you to complete the game to kill the enemy to defeat the enemies and don't forget to pick up the uh, item that it dropped one enemy that's all right see the time of I win because I basically I have uh, a number of nine kills on a second one hamster got four so I win this set um, now basically that's it